The Shenyang J-15T fighter, featuring advanced sensors, avionics, and domestically produced Chinese engines, has become a key addition to China's naval aviation. This cutting-edge aircraft is catapult-compatible, making it suitable for deployment on all of China's aircraft carriers, including the latest Catabar, or catapult-assisted takeoff but arrested recovery systems. For years, observers referred to it as the J-15B. However, on November 7, China's CCTV-7 officially designated it as the J-15T, giving it a definitive title. The J-15T's debut occurred at the renowned Zhuhai Air Show, formerly known as the China International Aviation and Aerospace Exhibition. This marked a significant reveal, following its appearance during dual carrier operations in the South China Sea alongside the Shandong and Liaoning carriers. Intriguingly, this came just a day after the public introduction of the Shenyang J-35A, a land-based medium-weight stealth fighter. Developed from the original J-15, which is based on the Russian Su-33 flanker, the J-15T features significant upgrades in radar, avionics, and weapons. This flanker-class fighter boasts twin engines, mirroring the design lineage of China's J-16 and J-11, themselves derived from the Su-27. The J-15T's catapult compatibility is a major advancement, allowing it to perform optimally from catabar carriers, such as the newly launched Fujian, rather than being restricted to ski jump launches from Stobar carriers. Key modifications for catapult operations include reinforced nose landing gear and a catapult launch bar. These features enable more efficient takeoffs with heavier payloads of fuel and weaponry, a marked improvement from the limitations of ski jump launches. The J-15T is now well equipped for full-scale operations, boosting the plans, People's Liberation Army Navy, carrier-based strike capabilities. One notable advancement is the use of the WS-10 Chinese turbofan engines replacing the Russian AL-31F engines that powered earlier J-15 models. The WS-10 provides superior thrust and performance, underscoring China's progress in jet engine technology. This development reflects a significant shift, as the nation no longer relies on Russian engines for its latest fighter jets, including the J-10, J-16, and J-20. Additionally, the J-15T showcases a redesigned ray dome, featuring a lighter gray hue and a slightly altered shape to accommodate an advanced AESA, active electronically scanned array radar, aligning it with 4.5 generation fighter standards. Inside the cockpit, upgrades include a new wide-angle holographic head-up display, akin to those found in China's premier fighters like the J-20, J-16, and J-10C. An enigmatic antenna behind the cockpit hints at further technological enhancements, though its exact purpose remains unknown. Armed with advanced weapons like the PL-10 Short Range and PL-15 Beyond Visual Range air-to-air -air missiles, as well as a variety of precision-guided air-to-surface munitions, the J-15T is ready for versatile combat roles. It complements the stealthier J-35 by handling larger, non-stealth-dependent payloads, making it an invaluable asset for the plan's expanding fleet. Furthermore, the J-15D electronic warfare variant, equivalent to the U.S. Navy's EA-18G Growler, adds an extra layer of capability. Reports indicate that approximately 68 basic J-15S-16 two-seat J-15S models and a small number of J-15D electronic warfare fighters are operational. The J-15T is steadily increasing in numbers, with at least 14 units in low-rate initial production. As China continues to enhance its carrier-based aviation, the J-15T stands as a testament to the nation's evolving military aerospace ambitions. To explore more about China's aviation advancements, consider subscribing and supporting my channel. Thank you for watching and see you next time.